Welcome to Celebrating Act 2. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life. Hi, I'm Donna Lynn from Vigor and Trim, a health and fitness membership site for people over 50, just like you and me. Today, we're at Celebrating Act 2, yay! And this is short and sweet, where you get to learn one exercise uh, tip and one nutritional tip so that you can stay healthy and strong and have an active lifestyle. Yes, yes. Today, we're going to work on that upper back. Yeah, because we don't get enough work there and we do a lot of bending over. All right, so I'm going to use a band. Now, you don't need to have a band, but having a band adds a little more resistance. They're easy to get and easy to keep, right? And don't take up any space, right? Anyways, I'm going to take this band. I'm going to put it right up here high along the bottom of my shoulder blades. Yeah? All right, let me move back a little bit so you can see a little bit more. There we go. Now, I'm going to cross the band in front just like this. I'm going to take the tails in my hands my palms are facing up, all right? And my thumbs are gonna face out. Now I'm gonna stagger my feet so that I have a little bit more uh, stability here in bending over. I'm gonna push my little booty out there with my abdominals engaged so I can protect my back. I'm gonna keep my hands up here by my shoulders and I'm just gonna press forward with my thumbs going up, all right? Keep squeezing those thumbs out and then come back in. Now you'll feel this all in the upper back. Keep those abs engaged. Arms stay at that same level as the shoulders. <sighs> Pressing, breathing, and come back in. Let's do one more just for good measure. All right, I'm going to keep the arms up by my shoulders. <sighs> Pull those thumbs apart. <sighs> feel that work right in my shoulder blades and a little below. Good job. Well, today we're going to talk about how do you keep those doggone vegetables fresh anyways? You know, you spend all that money on these wonderful organic foods and then they go bad. Well, there's a couple secrets to that. One of them is that you don't want to store vegetables next to certain fruits because fruits give off an ethylene gas and they will make the vegetables uh, ripen a little too fast and kind of rot, right? So we don't want to store vegetables next to apples, avocados, apricots, bananas, honeydew, chamoyas, and I think that's all I can remember. <laughs> that's a good start though, right? <laughs> so don't store them next to those things. Another tip is that you want to keep mushrooms in a paper bag, not a plastic bag. That brings too much moisture to those little puppies. All right, and don't put your potatoes in the refrigerator. Mm, that really doesn't make them taste good. Rather, take those potatoes, put them in a nice, dark, dry place. All right, you want to keep tomatoes out in the counter until it's a little bit too, you know, a little bit too soft, or they're just before they, uh, well, I'll just say that you want to keep them out on the counter for as long as possible. How's that? <laughs> then you can put them in the refrigerator, okay? And then we have a rule, a, F a FIFO rule. What does that mean? First in, first out, okay? Now, those should help you get started. Oh, I have one more. I almost forgot. Don't cut those vegetables too quickly, and you know, because if you cut them and try to prep them a little too early, you know, even a couple days or anything like that, because that air gets in and they really lose a lot of their nutrient value. So don't do that. Just wait until you're ready to use them, all right? All right. Well, hey, we're here because we want to stay nice and healthy and strong until we aren't anymore. Yes? Yes. And that's what I'm helping you with. So thank you so much for coming. This I'm Donna Lynn. This is Short and Sweet. We're at Celebrating Act 2, and we look to see you next week. All right. See you then. Bye-bye. For more on Celebrating Act 2, visit our webpage, follow us on Facebook, subscribe to us on YouTube, and tell your friends. Celebrating Act 2 is the user manual for the second half of your life.